Neighbors in St. Francis say they are scared after they saw snakes and alligators hauled away today from a home on their block. Police say a man inside that home was bitten by a snake, and as Pete Servakis explains, this is not the first time animal control was called to the home. It's dangerous. It scares you, you know. Wally Ditkewicz lives down the block from this home on South Clement Avenue. Police carried two alligators out this morning. Last night, six venomous snakes were also removed after a cottonmouth bit someone inside. One or more uh, bites from one of these, if they actually inject the venom, um, you know, they bite you in the arm, they bite you in the hand, you could lose that arm or hand. Police say 911 wasn't called until after the victim was at the hospital. Animal Control says the man bitten was Jeremy Loveland. We saw this man get dropped off and speak with police this morning. And in 2011, today's TMJ4 spoke to a man by the same name who suffered a viper bite at the same house. The people that keep these types of things, for the most part, believe they're experts, and they really aren't. John McDowell says the animals found this week were dangerous to the whole neighborhood. Wally agrees and hopes the city throws the book at the owner. It's always been a very nice neighborhood here. I hate to see something like this happen. Since 2011, St. Francis has implemented city ordinances putting restrictions on exotic pets. In St. Francis, Pete Zervakis, today's TMJ4.